So this is a demo of how Sedgda works uh, for making fillable spaces for your documents. So I'm going to load a document. And you'll see that here's all your options up here. <clears throat> you can actually use this for having people sign things. So like if you want your client to sign your contract, you can do that. Um, this is the text button that we're going to be using. So add new form fields. So you have a choice of a single line or uh, multiple lines. So we're going to pick multiple lines. And it gives you this box here. You just place it and then pull it down. And then it shows you that this is the font size that it will be. And that looks pretty good, actually. So I think I'll just keep that. So then you're going to have to do this for each one. But kind of gives you the same size as the other one, which is kind of nice. And so you just go through here and keep clicking on this. And this will make your fill-ins. Now, if you have uh, one-liners like this, then that's where you want this one line. And you make it all the way across. And then if you want to make the font size bigger, you can do so. So we can make this 14. And then you'll have to make one for each line. But at least it gives you, oh, uh, you can duplicate it. There's a duplication. Uh, you're just going to have to line it up, right? But it gives you lines, so that's good. So you can see there, and that one needs to come up a little. Anyway, that's how you do that. And then we'll go down to where we have some check boxes. I'll show you how to do that. <clears throat> So here we go, here we have check boxes. So we go in here and we click on the check box and then we can make our little check box and we can size it. And then I can duplicate it. Just keep duplicating it for all of these. And it'll give you those lines so you can pretty much line everything up. <clears throat> they just follow the lines. Now, if you have circles like this, um, you still can do a check box and you just check this and it'll give you a box. And then you can just line them up that way. You can see the little lines that come up when I get it right. And unfortunately, you can't really duplicate more than one of them at a time. So you've got to do all these individually. Um, but when you're done, then you can click Apply Changes. And then you'll be able to download it. <clears throat>